It's not a great day to be out at the zoo or anywhere in Edmonton, really, but the Edmonton Valley Zoo is in need of upgrades, and the director tells me without them, they could be forced to give up some animals. One in particular, the gravy zebra, which is uh, one of the many animals that are uh, that we participate in a species survival program with. Some of them, um, like our bald eagle, uh, doesn't isn't able to fly. We've got other um, birds, the older birds that have limited uh, mobility, do fly a little bit. Those are just some of the animal enclosures at Edmonton's Valley Zoo that require upgrades. Zoo director Gary Dewar tells me the zoo also needs some upgrade work done to facilities where animals receive medical attention for the animal safety and the staff, saying the zoo isn't in any danger of shutting down or losing its accreditation with the Canadian Association of Zoos and Aquariums, but without the over $10 million needed for upgrades, the zoo may be forced to make some tough decisions. If we're unable to provide for the care of that animal, then, then our option is to conceivably find a new home for that animal through, you know, at another potential zoo. The councillor for the area said, Sarah Hamilton tells me right now city officials do recommend council spend the money, saying she's heard from experts and Edmontonians on the role the zoo plays in conservation. Uh, it's hard to hear about, uh, I'm going to say, infrastructure issues that might be affecting um, animal welfare. And I think it's important for city council to hear um, in, in plain terms what those impacts are. This is all part of bigger budget deliberations, with some councillors warning there are tough decisions ahead. Reporting from Edmonton. Darcy Ropchan, City News.